sort it out now. Hello everybody, welcome back to Let's Play Fire Emblem the Three Houses. Last time we left off, we took on Lord Lonato and kind of left uh, uh, Ash feeling a little bit, you know, I, at this point under the weather. I don't blame the dude. But today we are going to do classifications for people who masked out their uh, starting class. So Dimitri is the first one that masked out his stats outside of Bi uh, Byleth. And we are going to make Dimitri into a soldier. You passed with 100% success rate. Uh, you didn't get a bonus level up either. Okay. Felix could turn into a couple things. Felix could turn into a fighter. That's actually not that bad. And the stat, ooh, the stat games are actually really good. Merlodon or Monk. I don't want Felix ever becoming a monk realistically, or like, oh wait, Felix isn't even maxed out his. Never mind, I need to double check that. Pretty sure Ash maxed out his, yeah, Ash maxed out his. And he could also become a soldier or a fighter. We're gonna make Ash a fighter. Come on, Ash, you got 100% success rate on this. Da -da. Way to go! You did it, Ash. Well, did not mean to do that. Anna could be replaced or changed, but I don't want her. Um, and that oh, you already had what you were going after. Oh. Wait, does she? Uh, she does. I just have, I have to reclass her now. Rosetta still can't do anything. Sylvain can't. I'm pretty sure Dudu could be changed. I just need to get on the level. Yeah, I need to get on the levels. Anywho, uh, and with that, we also have a ton of supports from that last conversation, or last fight. Okay, I had to skip it last time, but we'll see Dimitri's with, uh, with, uh, Byleth. Perfect timing, Professor. Ooh. If you don't mind, That's actually I have a favor I'd like to ask of you. What favor? It's in regard to sword training. Not for myself, but, well, to be honest, I've been teaching swordsmanship to the orphans at the monastery for a while now. Well, that's good. Good, good, good for you. How unexpected. How did that come to be? I mean, how did that come to be, first of all? That's a little more concerning. Some of them saw me sparring with the knights one day. They started pestering me to teach them. They were so earnest, I couldn't help but oblige. There's much I wish to show them, but due to my own studies and training, I'm afraid my time is rather limited. Which brings me to my favor. Your swordsmanship is unmatched. I hate to ask this of you, but would you consider lending me a hand? I mean, I'm already training you guys. Uh, you can, uh, you leave me no choice. You, you, you can me, Dimitri. Thank you, truly. I am in your debt. And I always repay my debts, I'll have you know. All of these children lost their families and homes to war or illness. This may sound well, a bit Well, they're all the orphans. I feel it's my responsibility to help them. I lost my parents without warning, too. In that way, we're the same. In Is that so? I lost my father, stepmother, and closest friends. I didn't have many allies at the castle after that. In truth, I had only to do for companionship. You have no other family? Is there no one else you could trust? Is there no one else you could trust? I once had people I could confide in. Family, friends, instructors, even the royal soldiers. But they were all taken away from me four years ago. Ah, but there were those outside the castle walls I was close to, such as Rodrigue. Rodrigue? <laughs> Pardon my rudeness. I meant Lord Rodrigue. He is my father's old companion, and the father of Felix. On the occasions he would visit the capital, he'd take me out hunting, or on long horse rides. While Dudu is like a brother to me, Rodrigue is more like a second father. It okay. might sound ridiculous, but he's the kind of man I hope to become one day. Someone who helps others. Someone who can reach out and save a lost soul. Oh, please, accept my apologies for boring you with my life story. 
In any case, it's not a bore, really. Your promise, Professor. I'm counting on you. And we'll do our best. To do oh, to do and Felix. This is something I actually want to kind of avoid for a bit. Hold a moment, dog. Are you speaking to me? I don't see anyone else here, do you? You're that boar's lapdog. Do not mock his highness. <laughs> Spoken like a good pet. Why do you follow him with such devotion? Do you really think a man like that is worth it? Fargus destroyed my homeland. Burned it all to the ground. Slaughtered my people. The punishment of Duska. My father, my mother, my sibling, all were killed. We received no aid, no respite. Fargus murdered our dignity and torched our pride. His Highness is different. He is the only one who sees my people as human. He risked his life to save mine, and it is thanks to him that I no longer wish for death. That's okay. what we call blind obedience. Tell me, would you give your life for him? Yes. And what if he commanded you to join him in a senseless massacre? I would do it. Okay. The massacre of children, or the elderly, or your own comrades. Without hesitation. You have misunderstood me. I am the sword and shield of his highness. Weapons do not have a will of their own. Blind obedience. I agree with Phyllis on this one. You're right. I did misunderstand. I shouldn't have called you a lapdog. You're a rabid cur. You and the boar prince make quite a team. Two crazed animals. I warned you not to mock his highness. I am aware you have a history of friendship with him, but one more word. I've said my piece. Scamper back to your master. I agree with Felix on that one. That's a weird one to agree on Felix with. So anyways, we have to explore. We don't have to. Actually, no, we are, because we're getting forced to this too. A hero's relic. Uh... You know something? How could I know something? Still, it is heavy on my mind. The stone within the sword. A glow of red. Hm? Oh, it is nothing. We share the same hair now. Okay. Anywho, we got a lot of quests and a lot of stuff just to kind of get out of the way. Okay. So, let's carry on. Smithing stone. Actually, I wouldn't mind repairing some of my weapons, too. Seeds, seeds, more seeds. Ooh, uh, a thingy that we could use. I've been in town procuring oh, set supplies of. for flame. Uh, you can in no, danger? But do not concern yourself for my safety. I am very much stronger than I appear. True, what's your quest? Something to ask of you. Um, gather information on the thieves hideout and then go find them. Right, and that's all. I think that's kind of where we're going. In a way. Also, we should probably go get that DLC mission. Look at our character use her little legs. Go! Okay, and what you got? Hey, Professor. How's it going? Making lots of coin? Eh, not really. Catch up, but I'm super busy right now. Working. For money. You understand. In a way. Hey. Bible secrets, okay. That's gonna be a very long term goal that we're not gonna have to worry about at all, practically, so don't bother yourself with the knowledge. Who's got a quest? Oh, Ferdinand. Setting fire to the stables to distract everyone, to cause a commotion. It is the oldest trick in the book, but I cannot shake the thought that our enemies may attempt it. I will stand guard and watch over the stable. And the knight's horses. They are truly magnificent. 
Okay, Ferdinand. What's your request? Okay, we can now give uh, Lawrence is looking for the tea set, I believe. So... Thankfully, I know my way around the monastery. Uh, anything? Earthworm. Okay, we're gonna do some fishing. Got some actual fish. More fish. And Lawrence. Lawrence. rite of rebirth is the most significant ritual for the Church of Seros. Could it be that someone has spread these rumors of an assassination plot merely with the intention to hinder the celebration? Possibly. Uh, but anyways, I have a tea set for you. I will have to repay you sometime. And Fernand, thank you. Also, we can now invite people to tea. Uh, inviting to tea. You may invite uh, your ally, uh, your allies to tea, uh, for a chance to uh, blah, 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 a chance to bond uh, if uh, possible. To invite them outside your your house, outside your house, with enough uh, support level behind a support level. I can read. So basically, tea time. We'll be doing it at least once, but I will guarantee you guys not until much later. Where I feel a little more confident with my skills, because as it stands right now, I play this game a lot. I still messed up on the tea time so much. So let's just get all the quests out of the way. All right, we gotta go all the way back there. We're gonna have a lot of free time to today to just kind of goof around. So I love Garrick Mock Monster. It's such a good song. Also, for those who don't know, I guess I could kind of plug this in because I kind of have a miscellaneous day or stuff to talk about. Um, this is actually a song they use in Fire Emblem uh, Heroes. You could get it from the Ether Resort. It's very fun. As I see it, our best option is to explore every inch of the monastery. We should also speak to everyone here. Let's plan to compare notes once you've got a lead. Okay. Will you do me a favor? And this question take too long. It's actually just gathering around information. The answer is always the same, so yeah. Okay, there's the set if quest done. We still have a couple to still do. It's not that much. But since we're down here, we might as well uh, report back the set if and also get the stuff done. Kind of go into like an anti or a, uh, a counter clockwise fat. No, clockwise fashion, right? Yeah, clockwise. I don't know why I said a, a, a counterclockwise. That's not. Kitties! I. Look at this kitty cat. Bye, kitty! Okay, now that we have this accessible to us. It would be terrible if the greenhouse was targeted. The plants in here are incredibly valuable. This place contains the heart of Garrick Mach's 995-year history. So many beautiful flowers, plants that can save or end lives. They are all my precious children. Okay, cool. I don't think that's what they'll be going after out of all things, because as much as it is to, uh, as, as cool as it is to get, like, a poison effectively, I don't feel like that would be necessarily their first objective. Uh, something in the Mystery that someone might go after. There's so much here I couldn't possibly name just one. Even this here kitchen contains precious wares, wine bottles from centuries past and the like. I hear that stuff is fancy, but not very drinkable. I doubt anyone would go to the trouble of stealing it. You'd be surprised, but I don't think we're dealing with common thieves. That's definitely a common thief situation. Well done. You have my thanks. Thank you. Said if I love you. And, and not in that kind of way. Just want to make sure we're not missing anything. Uh, we still got to talk to the person. I think this is Tomas, isn't it? Hello, Cas oh, Casper. I have a quest for us. I was just reading. Do you know him? He's a pretty big deal in the Empire. He only writes to ask how my training's going, or how many monsters I've killed, stuff like that. Okay. Hey, I got a favor to ask. Uh, ooh, the tournament organizer. That'd be fun. Try to recruit everyone we can. Oh, it's not Tomas. It's uh, you know what this room is. Random priest. 
It is the church's treasure vault. I say treasure, but I do not mean silver and gold and jewels. It mostly contains weapons, artifacts, and the like. Anything that would cause too great a stir, should it be stolen? No. The church knows better than to store anything too valuable in such an accessible location. Okay. Well, I mean, that's definitely more of what I would have pictured that our bandits are going after. Hello, Petra. Goodbye, Petra. Really? So I love the music in Fire Emblem once again. So like, if you just hear me randomly go off on that, I just kind of do that from time to time. Actually, is there blue? Is there sparkly blue? It's not sparkly blue. Okay. Also, if I'm not mistaken, Lysitia? Not here. Impossible. Hello, Louise. Visited the Goddess Tower. It's a sacred place used for rituals and the like. In general, students aren't allowed entry. But as you'd expect, that rule just excites their curiosity. <laughs> Some have even tried sneaking in. Well, okay. at least for this month, that kind of behavior is totally unthinkable. We have a lot more security. What with the Goddess's right rebirth coming up. True enough. Thank you. Thank you, Louise, for your time. And then up here, hello, Flame. Oh, he's a shiny. On the day of the rites, the monastery will be open to the public, including the Holy Mausoleum. The Holy Mausoleum is where the tomb of the Divine Saros lies. There she slumbers eternally. That's pretty much all that's in there. Just an ancient coffin. It's sealed with a powerful magic to protect against would-be grave robbers. Okay, good to know. That kind of information actually is pretty okay. vital. Ash, uh, sorry about that, man. Don't <sighs> really want to talk to you. Give you some time to air out. I feel like that might be the best. Also, quick question. How much, not supports, uh, storage house here, yep. How much property do we have? Glowing earrings from Duster, Dusker, uh, Antique or art, uh, art, art, artificial flower, uh, letter of condolence. God, I don't know who that is. Uh, used bottle of perfume, and someone who is telling jokes. Okay, cool. I think I know who all those go to, so there's not much of a problem with that. We'll be doing that this month and like as it comes up, just cause like I do like doing some of that. It's a nice little roundabout way of getting work done. Uh, hello, Catherine. Not here to see you. Uh, sometime soon. Well. So the next character up is Hanneman. Terrifying story. However, an assassination attempt on Lady Rhea is doomed to fail. Pardon? True. Sure. You think the goal may be different than simple assassination? Yes. Intriguing. I suppose the priceless objects in this room could perhaps draw thieves. However, there's no one but me who could make use of them. Alright, uh, so the worthless thing. Got it. Thank you, Hanneman. Oh, it's in my Wells room. An adult who appears to take a taste of liquor. Oh man. Oh man. I know who that belongs to. Library, guide to fishing. Uh I didn't read that. Never mind. Bob slipped. What do you gotta say? There's books in this library that you cannot find anywhere else. But once you are here. You can read them easily enough. I doubt someone would go to the trouble of stealing. Yeah, so knowledge is power, but it's not worth it. that are deemed inappropriate for the monastery, but that's about it. In a way, I suppose that makes those particular volumes more valuable, right? Yes. Thank you for your time. Thank you for your information. And now let me get the hell out of here. Because we got to report back to Dimitri and then start our roundabout way of... I am laughing at the shadows so hard. That shadow does not look like... 
You probably are supposed to run in this regalia, regalia. It just looks so funny because the skirt looks like it should not, or the skirt, the dress part should not look like it glitters that much. Okay, normal walking. Yeah, that looks fine. Like, that, it's not exactly super physics, but I mean, like, I'm not, it's just that that looks so silly to me. Thanks for your help. No problem. Thank you, so, Dimitri. There is something that the church values above all else. On the day of the rite, it will be open to the public. The Goddess Tower. We'll be gaining entry far easier than usual. You know the place of which I speak. The Tower of the Goddess. Holy Miles. Yes, that is the most likely possibility. We do not know their objective, but there is a good chance that our enemy is planning to target the Holy Mausoleum. Okay, Dimitri, that's good for you that you figure something out. Uh, next up is Taskbar's request. Also, I should start um, locating everyone I'm going to need to locate to get the uh, lost items checked out with. Also, what do you got? I bet the enemy is using this assassination nonsense just to sneak in and raid the pantry. What do you think, Professor? Uh, Raphael, I think you're a complete numb. Uh, you know what? You may be right just so you can get the affection up. My animal instinct is telling me that the enemy is after our best meats. Your, your animal instinct is also not in favoritism of what I do. Okay, so... Yeah, to do... Dorothea... Lacidia... Uh, Mercedes... Or not Mercedes. Ah, that's Marianne. Once again, I'm always going to get those names confused for some reason. It's just M names. I just don't know M's. Also, there is a lot of stuff here. Uh, You're skilled. Why won't you battle me? <laughs> Sorry. Also, no. Uh, oh, that just flat out says it seems uh, uh, so by Dimitri. Large physique, which will be Raphael. Uh, Someone who often finds himself in fights. That's Caspar. That's uh, Catherine. And enthusiastic about training. That's Felix. Let's get the Felix stuff out of the way for here. Hmm? Hopefully, it's someone worth crossing blades with. Felix, just because it's you. It seems we're cut from the same cloth. No, we're not. Uh, lost item. You know nothing about. Okay, it's not yours. I thought that was yours. Uh, flashy clothes. That's not you. Large physical physique. Liquor. Nope. Uh, nope. You know nothing. Want to test that? Uh, feels deeply. Okay. Yeah, it's not you. Dual fashion. Yep, yeah, okay, none of this is you. I thought that was you for some reason. So, let's get this out of the way. Who is good with swords? Felix? Felix, you're good with swords. Six or higher, meaning you're gonna hopefully do alright. Ah, uh, you do fine, actually, for the most part. Er. Just got that down. So tournaments, they are only here to get you money and the grand prize Grand prize if you live throughout the entirety of it. Is it worth it? Not necessarily. Do you want to do it? Eh, maybe, if, yeah, maybe you've got nothing better to do, possibly, but not really my thing. You get no experience, it's just to test your skills. Uh, Felix, you should be able to do this. I'm really hoping that this just gets like a crit at one point. Okay, quarterfinals, semifinals. You should survive easily. I'm gonna put you in a bit of a sticky wicket, but how am I gonna miss with a 2% shot? There you go, Felix. Okay, now we're at the finals. Let's restore Felix right back to full. 
so he doesn't accidentally KO himself. 10%, but we should be fine. There you go, Next Felix. Nothing stood in the way against Felix. The beginner store tournament. Congratulations, Felix. You got steel prize as a reward and also three hundred dollars. And a significant amount of professor level ups. Okay, or the professor grades. Our renown went up, and that's pretty much all I care for. So use ball perfume. I'm pretty sure that's Dorothea. Also physical physique. That would be you. You lost. Uh, where is it? Oh, hey! There you go. I right, have to lose stuff. Or please do lose stuff. Is it true you got caught in the fighting? Yeah. I'm so thankful you made it out alive. I don't know what we would do if we lost you. Yeah, you'll live, Dorothea. Dorothea, I believe you are the one who likes. Uh, where is it? Fashion, telling jokes. Wait, where the hell is it? I'm sorry, but yeah, I knew that wasn't yours. Oh yeah, here you go. Use bottle sorry, perfume. But... A bottle containing a rare perfume. It belongs to someone who cares particularly about fashion. Oh, well, Stormfield doesn't care about fashion. That's my mistake. Uh, red teal. Okay, that's Fernand, I believe. So, did you? Here you are. The monks declined my offer of assistance. They said that no one from Duster is to be trusted, especially now. Given the circumstances, I cannot fault them. That's still not your problem. You should not take that. That belongs to me. I apologize for the trouble. No problem to do. Happy to help. So now begins. Uh, who needs gifts? Everyone outside of my class. Uh, deeply repents. Uh, I believe that's Cyril. And Cyril is actually no, it's not Cyril. That's a. Uh, Marianne. I gotta, I always give her like a slight French way of saying it. I feel like that's French. I'm probably wrong. Marianne's in the Golden Theater house room. Top fishing spots. It seems there were forces opposing the church beyond Morbonato. I never thought such forces could exist in this world. Uh, it makes sense that the church has enemies. We only know a small part of the, this world. I mean, both are true, but it makes sense. I don't understand. What would they have against the church? And that's not the answer you wanted. Crap. Flashy clothes. Uh, who is it? Yes, this is mine. There you go, Marianne. You should probably not lose that. Okay, Marianne has to speak to us. You don't care for fashion. That's probably more. I want to say that's more, uh, Syl not Sylvain's Hilda, I'm pretty sure. So let's try to give. Actually, can we? No, it wouldn't be Hilda, because I don't think it's the characters like Did that. Did you know that on the last day of the rite, the monastery is open to the general public? It's kind of fun. It makes the place feel like a festival. Okay, Hilda. Oh, wait, here. Oh, we can get stuff to Hilda. Never seen it. Oh, I gave her the, I gave her the rose. That's not you. Oh, you found oh, so you can. I got confused for a second. Your class is on a festival day. I thought I'd get to spend all day relaxing in the company of some lovely ladies. But now this mess has happened. Hey, Sylvain. I know there's talk of an assassination attempt. Do you really think they'll do it on the day of the Rite of Rebirth? Quite possible. I feel like security would be looser some other time. Is there some reason why it has to happen on that day? Eh, you never know. Also, I believe the... Pass it again. 
Uh, where? Mysterious notebook, bag of tea leaves, the, the Thunder brand. Where's the perfume? Oh, maybe I got rid of the perfume. It was probably someone's. Oh, wait. Yeah, brain. Why do you not work? Caspar gets the fights of everyone. I was just reading this letter from the, do you know him? Okay, yeah, we, heard, we, we heard that. Okay. Hey, professor? I, cause some trouble. No? I didn't want that. I didn't want to oh, ask hey, you that yet. You know, he only writes... Lost item. You like to... Yeah, that's... Oh, but I thought the other one was for you, too. The enthusiasm of training. Okay, maybe the game gets rid of the stuff for you if it's, like, for the same character. That or I'm just completely bonkers. Let's, you do not know their objective. I don't want to give you a gift, I just want to give you the law oh, sword. Thank you. Motivation is increased. We have the antique flower and the alcohol. I know the alcohol goes to Manuela. The tea leaves go to Ferdinand. And I'm trying to remember the rest of it now. It is the oldest trick in the book. I will oh, Professor. Well, the eldest. I really did not mean to do that. I will stay. Uh. Yeah. Oh. Ferdinand, you know, belong to you. Often gets himself. So wait, that that, that describes Caspar though. Often gets himself into fights. Gets himself into fights. Gasper, yeah, I think I got another thing for you. Yeah, that's definitely. Okay, cool. Uh, telling jokes. That's Eloise. Case of liquor. Yeah. Okay. So let's go to Eloise and give that to him. I can't remember, was I trying to avoid doing this on my original recordings of the stuff? I don't remember if I was or wasn't. What am I recreating Marianne though? Mar Marianne is such a... She's such an interesting, like, topic, effective Topic. I'm treating her like a test subject. But she is a very interesting character. I actually want her, if anyone. It, sorry, Alois, you gotta shut up for a bit. Uh, you like this one. Oh, this is mine. Actually, I feel like I should explore a little more of the monastery because I think there's a lot more items just kind of lying around here and there. Hmm. I mean, I'm not gonna worry about it right now. I'm, like, this is by no means gonna be like a perfect run of everything. I just want to get stuff done. Da -da 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 -da. Zagging in and out, running around. That's so. Annette, Lynn Hart's over there. Manuela, you're here. Professor, I hope you're well. As for me, I had a date with a splendid specimen of a knight. But now he's suddenly not in the mood to see me again. I blame okay. all these rumors of a deathly figure showing up in town. Such an uproar must have, beyond reason, drawn his attention away from me. Manuela, I don't think now is the best time to be flirting around with men. Where Here you I go. Not the best Where time, Manuela. Uh, the Lawrence, you need the thingy. Oh. Graduate. Uh... Rick, where is she? That is Catherine's, I'm pretty sure. You're probably thinking, it's, uh, this entire episode gonna be just exploring the monastery? Uh, pretty much, actually. <laughs> pretty much, and then thinking about who we're gonna share meals with, because that's also gonna boost our stuff, too. Second floor. Catherine. You'd best keep in this nervous state. I might just cut you down. 
Um, I dare you to try. <laughs> oh, come on. I'm only kidding. Uh, gift. Not gift. Lost item. Oh, this is mine. Okay, I know I can't really recruit anyone, but I'm gonna see if I can try. Need something, Professor? I'm up until that's done. I... Uh, we just have low levels. Okay, so there are characters that kind of just are like, yeah, levels are too low. Daryl's quarters, nothing. Set of, set of quarters, nothing. You know, my, uh, Hanneman has nothing. So we got Leone. Like I said, like I'm not expecting to recruit anyone right now. I just want to see if I can. Hey, did you hear? A knife wielding a scythe is roaming around town at night. If he's a villain, I'd like to get the measure of him. Are you probably can? Hey, I hope we get a chance to practice together when you find the time. I know I'm in a different class, but you're the only other person here who's learned from Captain Gerald. Okay, yeah, you're not interested. Yeah, you care for strength and lances. Ugh. The two things that are actually pretty hard for a Merlodon. Uh, ooh, we got a support conversation with someone. So, we tried Caspar, right? Okay. Who wants to talk to us? Oh, it's probably, uh, Marianne. Yep, Marianne. Dear God. Hey, Ryan. You okay? Uh, professor, I suppose you came by to pray too. Uh, that's right. I'm just passing by, cleaning up the little I chapel. See. Well, that's why I'm here. Why? What are you praying for? Oh, um, nothing specific. I only call upon the goddess to give thanks, or perhaps to ask for protection. Anyhow, I should be on my way. Okay. Uh, do you have a moment to chat? I mean, I kind of um, talked for like two seconds. Okay. I mean, how's your I'm studying going sorry. along? I don't really know what to say. I'm not very good at talking to people. The truth is, I didn't interact with people too often before I came here. Okay, why is that? Got your reason. Oh, um, no particular reason. Do you just not like the sight of people? That's just how I am. Don't worry about it. I'm sorry. I'm sorry that uh, sorry to disturb you. Uh, don't worry about it. We'll find something to talk uh, about. Um, thank you. I'm sorry. You shouldn't waste your time worrying about me. Please, just ignore me. I'm not I already worried about you. Have to be going now. Goodbye, Professor. Uh, see you later. I feel like you should have rushed off, considering how embarrassed and stuff you were. But that's hey, neither here nor there. Hey, Professor? Oh, hey, Professor. Do you know oh, wait, we, we asked Caspar to join. He's like, nah, I'm good. Uh, who? Oh, it's just Tomas. Uh, Tomas can't join. Fernand, we asked already. Lynn Harvey could probably ask. Manuela? I don't remember who you could ask and who you can't ask. Hey there. Seeds that we don't really care for. Oh, Sedef, by Sedef. Hey, Lynn Hart. So sleepy. Too sleepy. Why's that? An interesting book in the library. So caught up reading it, I forgot to sleep. Interesting discovery, though. The coffins of the four saints in the sanctum each have their crests carved into them. I don't need to find a way down there to get a book. Uh, how about you not? Huh? Your class? I can see the appeal, yes. However, I still have a lot of books I wish to read in this class. Okay, yeah, you're not even remotely interested. And it's reason for Lynn Hart? Not think there's a reason. Lawrence, we've asked. Burn Dead, we need to ask. Uh, I think we're gonna recruit Shamir and Lysidia. They're probably not really in the mood to talk to me. We can't, yeah, unless we can't recruit you. 
Lawrence, I'm pretty sure we asked. Oh, we didn't ask Lawrence. Lawrence, you okay? that your reputation is on the rise. Even Lady Rhea, it's a shame I am not in your. Okay, yep, you don't care, you're a charm and reason. Two skills I'm not necessarily gonna sop myself after. Um, hey, Bernie. Uh, hi. Right now is, um, well, right now is okay, I guess. If you, uh, wanna chat. A little. Okay. Hey, I get hungry sometimes. Like everyone else. What? Eating at night is bad for you. <laughs> There's no way that's true. Wait, really? Uh, scientifically, yes, it is bad for you. Um, sorry, I'm trying, but you're still kind of a stranger. Okay, you're not interested. Strength and bows. Interesting. Uh, I think we could recruit Cyril. Maybe. It's rather next chapter or this chapter you can recruit Cyril. And I think Cyril's uh, requirements are actually one of the easiest ones to uh, get. I mean, since we're on the prowl for uh, lost items, you might as well just check people's rooms at this point. <laughs> Hey, Cyril, you are way the hell back here. Let's see, hey, excuse me. I just wanted to let you know that Lady Rhea is always real concerned with you. She expects great things, I think. Please don't let her down, okay? I don't plan to let anyone down, Cyril. I hope you're not just saying that. Alright, it's like next chapter or something. Okay, this is Sylvain's room. Dimitri's room, nothing. Felix's room, nothing. Claude's room, Jeez. Claude, clean your room! Man! Lawrence's room. Burn it. Burn it, really loves his armor, huh? Caspar's room. Caspar has like nothing. Each room is slightly unique, so that's why I'm like, huh. Hubert, very organized. Ilgar's room, standard. Hilda's room, standard. Well, get it there. Marianne's room. English room. All right, cool. Nothing. Maybe. Well, uh, pretty sure we did the greenhouse. So we have fishing and Lysidia to check up on. Possibly Shamir. All oh, right, I also could check these rooms, can't I? Landhart's room. Petra's room. Thea's room. And that's room. Now we go. Up we go. Hey there. Get away from me. Raphael's room. Ignots. Nope. Nope. Okay, so that's pretty much no one then. Hey, Shamir. You spend too much time roaming the monastery. If you're looking for something, try less aimless wandering. But I like aimlessly looking around. I was thinking about the enemy's objective. I don't think anything. Do you even know who the enemy is? You can't know why without knowing who. It's none of my business anyway. I'm just here to take care of enemies who get too close. Okay. Also, we can't recruit Shamir. Okay. Good to know. Uh, Inogard? I can't see Inogard. I'm taking Inogard right now. I would like to talk to Lysidia, if you don't mind. I don't know who's to blame for all this commotion, but it's frankly a huge inconvenience. With everyone stuck on guard duty, our study and training time has been drastically reduced. I mean, that's kind of what happens. Yes. I'm actually very busy right now. Yeah, you don't care. I right? eh, shush. Uh, well, I mean, I think all of our students are fed and accounted for, so we don't have to worry about our students. We could, we could bolster relationships with everyone else now. That's so. 
And I say we go do that. A head Chef Challenge. Okay. Yep. All of our students are accounted for. So, let's see who... What I really want. Uh, Leone and Lysidia. They have a good conversation sometimes. Grateful I get to eat every day. May the goddess bless this fine meal. Simple days like today are probably the ones you'll think back on fondly, you know? I hope so. We all grew closer. Also, I forgot a fish. I forgot a fish. Let's go fishing. Hello, I would like to fish, please. Thank you. But by one earthworm. Perfect. Okay. And hopefully we can get ourselves to a C in professor level. Okay, you guys accounted for uh hmm. I'll try to get characters that like the meals I want. Let's go Bernadetta and Dorothea. Yeah, you guys are okay. And next meal. If I could help it, I would prefer gain certain characters. Petra and Caspar. Uh, you know what? I'll take that. I try to woo everyone in every house, but I mean, like, there's only so much we can do. I would be liking that great. Oh, I could eat so. And, yep, Professor level up. We got the C rank. You now have more uh, activity points, including when you explore. Uh, the number of uh, uh, the uh, uh, it, I can't say that word. Holy cow, it's been a while. And our monthly funds will be going up. Also, master class has been a lot. Uh, the cooking book for cooking together has been expanded. Oh, uh, here we go. Um, augment. Odd, odd, odd. What, whatever. Basically, if you don't, if you can't, uh, what am I trying to say? This is so weird. Uh, once you reach Professor, L, uh, Professor Level C, you can assign, um, I'm trying to look at that word. Odd, a, a, j, adjacents. I, that's not how you pronounce that. Well, I, I'll I'll look it up later. Uh, to follow uh, follow you uh, follow bleh, to follow unit into battle. The number of um blank uh, <laughs> that you can assign to uh, per battle increases with your uh, professor level. Uh, depending on the cl uh, class of the aug augments, aug aug I guess I'm saying that. Uh, can provide uh, one of three uh, types of aid. Follow-ups, additional attacks uh, used in com uh, under attack combat. Attack and com combat. Guard, allows you to reduce damage by the follow-up attack. Uh, heal, occasionally heals um, the host at the unit at the start of the turn. Um, are, are more than effective in higher support ranks. Yeah, support uh, support levels. They get experience in battle, um, but you do not lose the weapon durability if they die in the if they die if you are hosting the defeat. Okay. So with that, we're gonna end the exploring today, and we're going to see what we can do tomorrow. Mean what we're gonna teach our students. I'm gonna ma I'm gonna manually assign them. Yep. So our task is Felix and you. Okay. So, let's get characters I want to have different job classes out of the way. Felix, I'm going to actually kind of play around with Felix a lot. So, Felix, I want you to learn a bunch of stuff, but for right now, let's give you a little more in your healing category, shall we? Nosferatu. 
this could be useful. Felix is not gonna be useful for you. Uh, Sylvain. I actually want to give Sylvain more of. Uh, well, yeah, I was gonna want to see Rick with uh, riding. It's all Dexterity plus four. That's amazing. And now I want to just pump everything into his reason. <laughs> There's very good reasons I want to do this. I didn't know I could okay, now I can avoid black magic by or uh, yeah, black magic by twenty percent now. All right, that's enough praise. Wow. Oh, I am so happy you're being a good student right now, Sylvain. I'm not gonna lie. Uh, Mercedes, I want you to learn more. Reason. Uh, Ingrid, you're fine right now, I believe. Ash, I could probably work on you a little more, but we'll wait on that. Ingrid, you have a you have a C in flying? Holy cow, I didn't ask but you have that already. Let's give you a C in lan or lances and like help it. Okay. I'm getting the hang of this. I would hope so. Uh, no big deal. Uh I guess for a fun turnaround, I'll give you a little bit of uh faith. Looks like I did it. For a nice little turnaround, and we can only train one more character. And that character I want to train is actually let's train Annette because her uh, faith is almost high. Thanks for your time. Yes. <laughs> well, it doesn't get Annette's like faith really high in general, so I mean, I'm just not really worried about that a whole lot. So Ingrid and Felix are working on Skywatch. That's entirely fine with me. I must ask you. Okay, what do you want to ask? Uh, no matter the weapon, I cannot. Uh, eh, it cannot be well, uh, wielded properly without uh, ample strength and stamina, regardless of the skill uh, uh, one may possess. I, I believe being. Uh, blah, 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 blah. I believe in uh, using various training techniques, but uh, but lately I feel like I, they've all been lacking. It may be necessary to increase the strain intensity. Um, that feeling is actually a, uh, is a sign of progress. That's definitely not a sign of progress. Try focusing on <clears throat> try focusing on one skill at a time uh, for a while. Try increasing the intensity. I, so. I don't know if that's the right answer or wrong answer, but I feel like that's kind of more or less what he's looking for. Sure, feed me all that. Uh, That's not a change, but sure. Oh, so almost that Ingrid wants to hang out with us. Okay. The third time this month. Well, that's that. Father never relents. Oh, Professor. Hello. Did you need something? Uh, are you hiding something? What was that just now? Well, um, that is. I was just tossing out something I have no need of. It's important to keep our spaces clean, after all. You Is that so? To remember that too, Professor. A clean space makes for a clean mind, or some such. Getting rid of things you have no need for is the first step to managing one's belongings in an economical way. That sounds like you're just trying to hide something even more. Uh, could you help me tie uh, my room sometimes? Um, are you, um, that are you the trifling type? Want to help clean my room? Might as well ask. I'd love to. Just say when, and I'll be there in an instant. Despite my family's nobility, we have never been particularly wealthy. So my father raised me to be conservative with my resources, paring down when necessary. He also encouraged me to keep my living spaces immaculate. So the two go hand in hand, I suppose. Yes, good enough. 
He sounds like a good father. Uh, he's the finest example. Uh, I'll be happy to follow. He sounds like a good father. Yes, he's a good person. Even when managing our territory used up most of our family's resources, he still went out of his way to ensure my comfort. Uh. Oh, uh, just a scrap of paper. Yep. It was already written on, so no good for note taking. And obviously, I can't use it to clean my lance. So I tossed it. No need to hang on to inconsequential things, you know. Is that so? Professor, did you come to check on me for any particular reason? I hope Sylvain and Felix aren't getting into trouble as they tend to do. No particular reason. I just wanted to talk to you. Let's go on a nice, gentle approach. I just wanted to talk to you. Oh, well, if there's nothing important, I'll be on my way then. I still have some cleaning to take care of, after all. Talk to you later, Professor. I probably played way too heavily into that, didn't I? <laughs> yeah. Well, I mean, I got the, I got the good job. Uh, the hymn. Sure, let's join in with the hymn. Our two randoms are Felix I'm and right. Ash. I hope I'm not too off. Not sure I should sing with everyone. I'm not great at harmonizing. I mean, Felix, you needed the the good stats for you. It was his birthday. Would we'll send him flowers, cause we're not. Er, I said Felix. That's Flane. I'm smart. We'll get this done. I hope you two got it right. done. No time to lose. Happy now? No. You guys got a perfect. That's remarkable. Each new experience is an asset. Battalion's raft. I'm a natural. Bologon. I, I can't pronounce that right. I don't care for you. I don't care for you. You may be in my class, but I generally don't care for you. So let me get this. Just take a look at this. We have one, and there's no particularly good mission. Well, I'm not gonna lie. I think next. Uh, I think on the next part, we're gonna just uh, end up. Uh, end up. I can't. I can't words. We're gonna end up uh, just uh, exploring the monastery and cooking for everyone again. That's probably a good way of going about it. So, anyways, I'll see you guys on the next part of Let's Play Fire Emblem Three Houses. I'll see you guys later.